We are here celebrating success to recognize both individual and collective achievements for the health and safety accomplishments that work to protect our most valued, our people. We've seen that companies that work with us most closely have seen an almost 24% reduction in the injury rate, meaning that more workers are going home to their families. The manufacturing industry is growing, and with their growth, technological changes are happening within the manufacturing sector across Canada and, and across the world. So with that are coming emerging health and safety risks, and with that we are seeing risks such as radiation sources used to help support quality assurance activities within the manufacturing industry. We're a small facility, so we, we wear a lot of hats in this place. Uh, everybody does multiple jobs, multiple tasks, and for health and safety, we didn't really have an expert. We're a medium-sized business, and that's really, uh, it's a challenge. And MSA actually provides all the expertise that we need. They're a quick phone call, even just for a question. Uh, we want to know something, we know the experts, and we get the answer quickly, efficiently, and, uh, and they're always there to help when we need them. We felt that we needed a push. I think in most things we do, we plateau. We push really hard and we, we tend to plateau, and you need a catalyst. And I think the OSSE certification was really a, uh, it was a great catalyst for us to force us to, to look at what we do and be better. We started with the Alliance um, after a, an accident in the plant took the life of a young worker. And that was an event that um, not only impacted the young worker's family, but the entire community. And it was at that time we you know, realized that the safety program that had uh, served us for many, many years needed a complete revamp and retooling. So we took the advice of a, one of the WorkSafe BC inspectors and started the engagement with uh, Fiosa Miosa, which is now MSA. Everyone here from you know, the receptionist to the plant worker, to our client services, supervisors, everyone lives and breathes safety. There's not a decision that's made in this business that doesn't start with safety. We first got involved with the Safety Alliance approximately two years ago, and the idea was to improve our safety management system. It's incredibly important to us uh, to strive to be a world-class organization. You, you sort of have an idea of where you need to go as a safety professional, but it's easier said than done. And I think it's very important that it goes from safety department directing safety to permeating throughout the, the company and the company and all the employees having buy-in. When you look at this company, you know, it starts at the, at the top and, and it's absolutely the number one priority and they show that by the, the support they give in the training programs and the equipment they buy, in the time they give for safety meetings, the time for the Josh Committee, all these things combined help move the safety culture in the direction that you want to go. Coupled with a 24% drop in time loss injuries, organizations see improved identifying, hiring, and retention efforts when it comes to recruitment. They see drops in WorkSafe at BC premiums and improved and stronger brands. 2020 is all about helping our members continue to see the reduction in injuries, bringing more workers home to their families. So with that, we're partnering with BC industry leaders within the manufacturing sector to achieve cultural change that ensures safe workplaces for all workers and employees within the organization. And we are seeing that success.